I credit my brother so much for my, my transformation. I couldn't have done it without him. Kelly recently revealed she had gastric bypass sleeve surgery two years ago, but her transformation actually began after she hit what she calls a spiritual low from drinking, and she called her brother Jack for help. Tell me about the phone call you made to Jack. <laughs> Jack had texted me saying, I know what's going on. When you're ready, call me. I'm here. And I was like, excuse my language. F you. I don't know. But inside I was like, he's right. I'm dying. I waited a month and then I called him. And she like burst into tears and was like, I want to be a skinny winner. I was, like, <laughs> I was so <laughs> drunk. <laughs> I was like, okay. Well, I'll come get you and we'll figure this out. Now three years sober, Kelly seems happier than ever, but maintaining her weight loss is hard work. She said the surgery curtails emotional overeating, but she has to eat right and work out. Otherwise, the weight will come back. I am still a bit like, <gasps> because I think I will always be that insecure fat girl who a little unsure, but you know what? Now I'm having fun with it. I don't want to be like a model. I'll probably just get bigger rather than smaller. Adele was a bit off with that prediction in 2008. She shook up social media in May after sharing this photo, revealing her 100-pound weight loss. And the Grammy winner just poked fun of all the frenzy on SNL. Because of all the COVID restrictions and the travel bans, I had to travel light and only bring half of me. Reportedly, Adele's fitness routine includes Pilates, and she follows a meal plan based on the book Cirque Food Diet. Rebel Wilson looking fit after losing 40 pounds. In January, she vowed to make this the year of health, and she's chronicled her journey ever since. She's cut out junk food and has been super active, going on hikes and hitting the gym. Walk, walk, I feel so much stronger. I feel so much healthier. I definitely was not going into this to lose weight, to get into some great dress that I had. Marissa Jarrett Winoker, known for her Tony winning role in Hairspray, did show off her 50-pound weight loss in a patriotic bikini top. When COVID started, they would put out, are you overweight? Do you have pre-existing conditions? Have you had cancer or asthma? And I was like, check, check, check. The only thing I can do is try to get off the high risk for being too overweight. My exercise routine, it's pretty intense. I basically walk or run three, three miles. Then I work out an hour with Keith Anthony on his Zoom classes. I do that five days a week. And Marissa made a major change with her diet. Before the mom of one would often eat out or get takeout, but now she cooks at home. It's funny because as my food changes, I'm like, oh, I don't have as much asthma. I miss the chips, I'm not gonna lie. And I'm not drinking any of my calories. Never ever drink your calories.